Hi everyone, and welcome to my channel. Today, I'm going to be talking about the main hazards in the workplace. These are the things that can cause accidents and injuries, so it's important to be aware of them and take steps to avoid them. Slip, trips, falls. One of the most common hazards in the workplace is slip, trips, falls. These can be caused by a number of things, such as wet or slippery floors, uneven surfaces, and obstructions. To avoid slip trips, falls, it's important to be aware of your surroundings and to wear appropriate footwear. Falling from height. Another common hazard is falling from height. This can happen when working on ladders, scaffolds, or other elevated surfaces. To avoid falling from height, it's important to use all necessary safety equipment and to follow proper safety procedures. Falling objects. Falling objects can also be a hazard in the workplace. This can happen when working with machinery, lifting heavy objects, or storing objects overhead. To avoid falling objects, it's important to secure all objects properly and to wear appropriate personal protective equipment. PPE. Collision with objects. Collision with objects is another common hazard in the work. This can happen when working in crowded or cluttered areas or when operating machinery. To avoid collision with objects, it's important to be aware of your surroundings and to take precautions to avoid accidents. Trapping crushing under or between object. Trapping crushing under or between object is a serious hazard that can lead to death or serious injury. This can happen when working with machinery, lifting heavy objects, or operating vehicles. To avoid trapping crushing, it's important to follow proper safety procedures and to be aware of your surroundings. Manual handling. Manual handling is the lifting, carrying, pushing, pulling, or moving of objects. This can be a hazardous activity if not done properly. To avoid injuries from manual handling, it's important to use proper techniques and to lift objects. Electricity. Electricity is another serious hazard in the workplace. This can happen when working with electrical equipment, wiring, or outlets. To avoid electrical hazards, it's important to follow proper safety procedures and to be aware of your surroundings. Contact with chemicals. Contact with chemicals is a hazard that can be present in many workplaces. This can happen when working with chemicals, storing chemicals, or cleaning up chemical spills. To avoid contact with chemicals, it's important to follow proper safety procedures and to wear appropriate PPE. Fire and explosion. Consequence of an event. Fire and explosion are serious hazards that can be present in some workplaces. Fire can happen when flammable materials are present or when electrical equipment malfunctions. Explosion can happen when flammable materials are present and when there is a source of ignition. To avoid fire and explosion, it's important to follow proper safety procedures and to be aware of your surroundings. Conclusion. These are just some of the main hazards that can be present in the workplace. It's important to be aware of these hazards and to take steps to avoid them. By following proper safety procedures and being aware of your surroundings, you can help to keep yourself and others safe.